she took a black. Now here, Nancy is five months pregnant. And um, she's on her way to this prison place. But check it out. Rehabilitation. What they had done is they put these wooden walls up. So I went inside and my husband was there. There were no words exchanged. There were 40 people living in that space. 40 people. Quite a shock. by Hubbard himself to live in a garage knowing that I was five months pregnant because they don't give a damn about babies just disgusting but little did I know things were about to get a whole lot worse the woman's dorm contained bunk beds it was all dark there was never a light Damn, that's worse than prison. Exhaust fumes. Exhaust fumes. You get better treatment in jail. In jail, they don't turn the lights off. Of cars. I had somehow allowed myself to end up in this place. Yes, she said. She allowed herself to end up in this place. Now... Um... To me, this is not, uh, and I, I wouldn't blame L. Ron Hubbard for this. I'm not going to blame him for this. I blame these people. I mean, their control of their mind and body. They allow someone to tell them this, 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 and this, and she knew that L. Uh, L. Ron Hubbard saying he was next messiah she knew that she was crazy but she still stayed now she's in prison and she's five months pregnant didn't see that living the last three months of, of a pregnancy in a garage as something bad we needed to do the rehabilitation because that's going to be better not only for Scientology but Nancy and me it's going to be better you hear that it's not going to be better just for Scientology, but for him and Nancy. How can you think such it foolishness? We had to meet together every morning for a muster. In which Look how they hold their heads down. They are slaves. I swear this reminds me of this movie. I can't think of the name of it, but it deals with cars. It has something to do with Aster Crowley too. And a Ford. Dealing with a Model T Ford. That's what this kind of shit reminds me of. Trevor counted. And then several teams would go out and do different work. They give me the rules. I was to call it everyone, sir. I was not allowed to go anywhere alone. I could not use a bathroom that the normal staff used. Wow. Went on and on. If you broke their rules, you would be given a punishment. That's not enough punishment. Check this One out. Of the rehabilitation project force is that you ate after all the normal people ate. And after all the normal people. The leftovers. When I was hearing everyone saying, oh, we ate the leftovers, I didn't know they meant that they ate the leftovers of these other ones' plates. Now, see, and this is what I'm saying. The people who are getting up and knowing they're coming in and eating the food off their plates, they knew that was, that was some fucked up shit, but they didn't tell. You know why? Because it hadn't happened to them yet. These niggas don't want to leave until the shit happens to them that they do to others. And a lot of children have gone through this shit. I'm scrounging off of people's plates. 
Wow. They're garbage. Wow. It was the most humiliating experience. But there were no locks at the rehabilitation project force. I was there on my own. There were no locks. She was there on her free own will. free will. Wow. I didn't leave because it's your instinct to stay there. You're connected at such a deeper level. Then they have to wash the plates. They hate the leftovers off of. And she said, you're connected at a much deeper level. Now she does get her ass out of there. Okay, she has a baby. She got to drop it off with whoever keeps the baby. And she takes her dumb ass back to work. She says she knew it was nuts. They are nuts. You, you have, Something is wrong with your mind. To, for all these people to be caught up in this kind of shit, something has to be wrong with your brain cells. Wow. And they said, yo, it, being, yo, it was a cult. I don't think so. Oh, but you know, he, everyone hurried up and put him out of business. But Scientology can kill, still go on. I wonder why. And I was shocked. Chris and I were going to be running one of the major organizations uh, in Scientology. We moved to Los Angeles. This is why people, a lot of people want to be in Scientology because a lot of actors come from out of Scientology. Um... A, a lot of them who escape or whatever, right out, they say that Scientology, uh, you know, like go and um, can talk the actors into coming into Scientology, but no. A lot of these actors come from Scientology. Uh, there's a girl named Leah. She came from Scientology. Let me know. She's not the only one came from Scientology. Scientology has always been about this. Man, I'm going to show you the studio and shit. I mean, anyone with a studio like that and you're in L.A., they're about those movies and shit. So, they pick and choose. That's what they do. They pick and choose who's going to be on the screen and who's not. And in all of this, I did find a video where it says that uh, Will Smith and Jenna Pickett are part of Scientology. And they're melanated ones. Also, their ch their children um, are being taught, you know, that they can love anyone, male or female. And that's Alistair Crowley shit. But yet, they belong to Scientology. A lot of shit Scientology said they're not about. It sure is a lot of shit like that going on, like... They're not about pedophilia, but yes, you are. They're not about um, being gay, but yes, you are. Um, they're not about murderers, but yes, you are. They will have people come in and confess that they're pedophiles, but Scientology will hide that. And, you know, as long as they either join if they don't have any money or they have to... Uh, take all these courses because now you told them all your secrets. They know every fucking thing on you, man. They can do whatever the fuck they want to do to you. Wow. I, I mean, who in the right mind does that shit? Now she goes from the rehabilitation progress force to here. Celebrities like come out of Scientology. Which was great fun. Here are people who have instant contact with the press and with millions of people at large. And, and they forgot all about what the hell they went through. If I had to go through that every time I see this kind of blue, shit. <laughs> that would fuck with my mind. celebrities to try and connect up with other celebrities. Scientology absolutely takes advantage of vulnerabilities. Scientology absolutely takes advantage of vulnerabilities. But we're all vulnerable in certain places, but uh, Scientology 
you know, some of us just have sense. I just put it like that. Some of us know how to use our own mind. And I, I already know, if you're out to, uh, I don't know how we can save the world with all these fucking bombs going on, but the thing is, is just to help the next man next to you. And that's how you save the world. You don't need to go and, and, and go to prison for no bullshit, some bullshit and you, you don't need all this kind of shit. This is Satan. This is the devil. And they're just selling their souls to the devil. Not only are they selling their souls, they're selling their next life and their next life and their a billion fucking years. Every time you come, you will belong to the devil. They just call it Scientology, but this demon motherfucker is a devil. <laughs> Goes, let me know when he falls on a banana peel. These things were very manipulated. See, they're only they're, they're spies. They're getting information from them without them even being hooked up to the e meter. They're spies. That's all she is. She is a spy. And then once these Scientology people leave Scientology, they come out and tell everyone uh, they're held as being famous. And then they have books, and their books are number one sellers. But every book I've ever seen is a number one seller. That doesn't mean shit. But they become famous. And uh, they're criminals. That's why I say pl prison planet. Because people, they l love criminals. Criminals are held very up very high. I mean, look at Obama. Look at all the government bullshit. Look at these judges and... And, and how they bring over drugs and all the other kind of bullshit all these higher up motherfuckers do. Drop bombs on babies and shit. Nobody cares. Because uh, this is a prison planet and this is where the criminals are worshipped. If you're not a criminal, then you are a suppressive person. Or a demonic spirit. Everyone is creating this false world around you. I swear I feel like that. You think that's wrong? Everyone is creating. Everyone is creating this false world around me. What was to the forefront of my mind was how much fun this was. Well, how much spying on people was. <laughs> Look at this. I was handed <coughs> a piece of paper, and it said that Chris and Nancy Maney are to report to the rehabilitation project. My worst fear has actually come true. Now they throw their asses back in the... See, they only take... It. Man, they only take these people out so you can go out and you can spy for them. And then when you come back in, you go back into the prison hole. Dangerous persuasions. These are damn puppets on a string. But my thing is, when they leave, they seem to have an okay life. Everything seems to be okay. But uh, those that never heard of Scientology or... Maybe you were approached by Scientology and you just don't remember... Or those like me who turned them down, man, I I life turns to a living hell, <coughs> but not like well, you know, you're in prison like that. But they do put us in prison in a form of a way, and that's another reason why this is a prison planet because they are holding the, the criminals. Uh, running everything and they will hold your mind your body your spirit to soul everything they will hold in prison and Scientology is a dangerous thing to be about man it's hard and people say Scientology is falling but no Scientology is not falling Scientology has all these uh, 
is celebrities. Now when all them damn celebrities start leaving and shit, they still won't fall because now they have anywhere from four to five thousand Negroes. And they are the nation of Islam. Those will be the next puppets on a string. Sitaka. Lahi votes.